What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. I am Brian and today I want to make a quick video showing you how to adjust the Futura harness on the Mystery Ranch Unicorn 2.0. I know that if you're a Mystery Ranch fan, you already know how to do this, but there are a lot of newbies to this company as a result of this pack, myself being one of them. And if you didn't know any better, you might have gotten the pack and said, what the heck, why does this thing feel so small with how it wears on my back? And there are adjustment videos out there, but none that I've found for this pack and I think this pack is a little bit unique in terms of making the adjustment for two reasons. The first is that it only comes in a medium and small harness size. So if you have a long torso like I do, you maybe need to account for that. And other packs have waistbands. This one really just has a strap. And so the adjustment to me is a little bit different. And in terms of how you do it, I really just went for comfort. I intuitively tried to basically just place this padding in the small of my back. When I run this initially, it sits so far above the small of my back. The small of my back is probably about right here. And the top of this sits probably two to three inches too high. So the big thing was getting that to come down to the small of my back where it feels comfortable. And there is a lot of adjustment to this harness. So you'll see here, I went and added yellow tape to the initial position of this harness. It ships in kind of the smallest setting, which makes sense because that makes it easy for shipping purposes. But let's get this adjusted to what I like. And in terms of how I did it, I did not load the pack up. It really made it a lot easier to adjust. What you do, you basically pull on this label tab and it undoes some Velcro. You wanna loosen the shoulder straps as much as you can to get a lot of freedom to operate in here. And then you're gonna pull out the yoke adjuster, which is a structural element of the bag. It's sitting behind this flap you pull it out and then you actually use it to break the Velcro that locks the harness in place. So you go ahead and you push it down until the harness has freedom to move sort of up and down. You'll see here with the yellow tape, now I can slide it. That's pretty significant in terms of how much I've slid it. So. After it's in this setting, I basically threw it back on my back. And I basically played with the adjustment until I had the pack with the back padding resting right in the small of my back where I like it. And that's where it's comfortable. So. To me, that's kind of the most important adjustment. You know, with other packs, they talk about a 45 degree angle with the shoulder straps coming off. I think the medium small is just honestly too small for my frame to be able to get that adjustment properly. So to me, the most important thing, the back support and how it sits, I don't want that bump sitting higher up than the small of my back because it's just gonna be uncomfortable with how I wear it. So this right here is a very comfortable setting for me. And if you look at that, wow. I've adjusted that seemingly three to four inches up from its default setting. The cool thing about this is that with the yoke adjuster kind of three to four inches higher, it actually frees up a lot of space in the bottom of the bag. So to finish this up, we just insert this back in here after kind of pressing that down to make sure the Velcro locks the setting in place. Go ahead and throw the flap back over the top. And now this is set up to go the way that I like. So at this point, we can cinch down the shoulder straps.
And there we go. That about does it. I hope that you find this video helpful. If you do, go ahead and let me know in the comments. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Thank you for watching and I will see you at the next one soon.